What's up guys going on? Good morning. It's Ryan here. Ryan Beats. How's everybody doing? It is Thursday. Thursday in Fort Worth, Dallas. I gotta stop saying I'm in Dallas because the people out there is uh <laughs> make, making fun of me and uh correcting me. I'm in Fort Worth. Let's just put it that way, okay? I gotta stop saying I'm in Dallas because I'm technically I'm not in Dallas. Oh. Running a little late, oh, I think. Well, I'm not running late. It's a little past 9.30. Um, I think the classes start at 8 this morning, but the expo floor opens at 10 every day. Yeah, so um, running a little late, <laughs> but it's okay. Class don't start till later. Um, Wait, how do I start this thing again? Push on the gas, hit the start button. Woo! That I like. I had breakfast this morning. I tried their um, breakfast uh, um, restaurant or their restaurant. I, don't, I thought it was um, complimentary breakfast, but it's not. But um, I'm not gonna do that again. I think I'm just gonna go across the street. There's a McDonald's across the street. I'm gonna try that. It says it's gonna take me about 20 minutes to get to um, the convention center, which is great, but I still have to figure out parking, so I'm not really sure where to park. I don't know. Today, hopefully, is a good day. Well, it's gonna be a good day. Uh, I got my uh, bag full of uh, um, shirts to give out. Oh, I only put some in there. So I have a couple more in the rest of the uh, the rest of the week or the rest of the show. So yeah, I only have a couple of sizes for everybody. So um, if I don't have your size, I am sorry. Well, anyways, enough of that. Let's get going. downtown I actually took about 15 minutes what wait what is this look at that must we well just go over that thing oh crap oof six dollars all day okay that's not bad I'll take it but it's gonna be out here in the sun all right I'm parked um I had to move around a couple of times because my original parking was in the yellow uh, stalls that was 15 bucks this is just six bucks all day but I'm out here in the sun it's gonna be uh, blazing hot anyways let's go look for this um, convention center man it is freaking hot it's like 10 10 it's got to be at least 70 right now or 80 all right look I found the convention center how do I cross the street Oh, you push that button, okay. I should have just stayed at the Hamptons across the street. What is that over there, the Hilton? Man, well my drive wasn't that bad. It was a uh, 15 minute drive. Not too bad, I'll take that all day. All right, we gotta walk around. I guess the back door is not a public entrance. Still gotta get my badge. I don't know who's gonna be here. Man, I'm walking all the way around. See those people back there? Smokers. If you guys smoke, try to stop. It's really bad for you. Man, I just realized I just parked on the back side of the um, convention center, which sucks. I don't wanna walk that far to the car. Well, it's definitely gonna suck. Cause what if I win something? Something like a, another press or something. <laughs> How am I supposed to bring that? And I can't even bring it back with me anyway. Maybe I can UPS it, right? I could probably do that. Pay like 80 bucks to get it shipped or whatever. Not bad for some free, right? Look at all that noise over there. So there's a convention. I can't get in this way? Oh. There it is. I see the sign. There it is. That way. I should turn the uh, 
the arrow around, huh? Where's registration? Oh, registration's over here. Look, got the badge. Press badge. And I got the regular one. <laughs> Let's just take a walk and see what is going on here. There's your stalls. Oh, a different booth. Oh yeah, Scoob wanted me to check something out here. Let me find it. Alright guys, we're here at 613. Remember Rick over here? He's gonna press a shirt for me. With the whole spiel, huh? Yeah, no, right. just... Yeah, we are uh, decorating the San Mark District Perfect Weight Tea. This is 100% green spun cotton, 4.6 ounces, super soft, super light. If you're a t-shirt snob like me, you can get yourself some distance. Oh, there you go. This is our uh, single color, single image program. Now, this is not my 15 cents, it's a little bit bigger. This is my 20 cent right? $22 setup in that varsity formula. And of course, everything we do is gonna be seven seconds. 60 PSI are heavy on a manual press. Uh, this particular product is a 325 degree application. But go on, go on polyester, go on almost poly cotton blends, and everything we do is hot field. As soon as that press opens, I remove that carrier sheet. And just like that, Ryan's shirt is ready to go. Awesome. And that nice metallic silver, we did a nice shot. Geometric uh, longhorn design for our photo show. Awesome. Thanks, Rick. All right, I just met up with Chris Gill. Sorry, Chris, I didn't get you on video. If you're still here, I'm gonna look for you. But uh, nice to meet you, man. Yeah. Definitely a lot more better than the Houston one. Uh, we're gonna go check out. Uh, where we go? We're gonna go check out. Uh, TRW. Click on that, so I have all that selected, and I'm gonna change that to a glitter. Just gonna let him talk. Gold glitter. What's up? <laughs> How are you? Good, good. You guys know Matt. I'll be back, Matt. All right. That's why it's doing. Yep. And Neil, my patches, lemon jackets. So it's like more like a yarn. It says on the bottom. Let me get a closer look. Alright, here's TechSource. Oh, you know, This is the Hicks Rally. You guys see that? Hicks Rally Press. Right now it's set up as a 4-4. You can go as small as a 4-2 bench press and all the way up to a 6-6 rotary press. Um, it is fully upgradable to um, a side clamp and an air assist, so it's gonna be like a semi-automatic. You guys can see the head's a little bit different. That's what kind of intrigued me. But look, if you push down on it, that's the gate. Got your micro registration here. You got your X and Y and your Z and your off contact here. Make that the size. Yeah, how it goes up, look. Show our demonstration, watch it go up. And this is the actual press that I use. See how it goes up? It doesn't snap back like a spring. You don't have uh, squeegees flying everywhere. But that's your rally press right now. The show price is $33.95. I think it's good till the 14th. 
So that is your Hicks Rally Press. So if you guys are looking for equipment other than the regular equipment that you guys see, check out the Hicks. It looks great, it's all aluminum. It's made here in the US. No welding. And what, once again, it is upgradable to a 6.6 six press. Look at the specialty materials. Look at this. That's really neat. I don't know. Kind of want to get into uh, HTV a little more. It's nice. Whoa. Interesting. There's sin. Always trying to get into trouble. This pattern right here. Got the Hawaii pattern or the, uh, the flowers. That's really nice. Also got to meet the big guy there, that's David. Wow, oh, that's pretty neat, look at that. Looks like it's screen printed, but a little HTV gives it a texture. I found the candy. Oh, Sour Patch Kids. T-shirt help this is uh, getting blasted right now. <laughs> I didn't know about her at the time, but look. Guess what, I'm here at BWM. Matt had to go use the bathroom. <laughs> I don't know where he went, but I'm watching his booth. Look, I'm by myself here. By myself. Man, I really want this. It's a nice press. So if you guys are wondering, this is uh, the newer version of the press that I have. This one's the Pro Line. It has an option for a side clamp. So it does have a lot of accessories here, some stuff for the automatic. Got this new um, the slim line um, bracket, like that, instead of the older ones, which is those brackets compared to this one. Uh, if you guys are doing like nylon jackets, you know, those windbreakers type, you will need this to screen print so it won't, uh, the jacket won't move. So what you do is put your jacket in here, put it down, and then twist it over, and hold it down flat. You can screen print. You put your head down, you can screen print. So, <coughs> I forgot what this is called. It's called the nylon hold down or the jacket hold down but yes if you're planning on doing nylon windbreaker types get yourself one of these Woo! so uh chris bradford and eddie uh very nice to meet you guys sorry i didn't get you guys on camera i didn't want to make you feel awkward or anything like that or weird but that's it uh we're going to the after party gathering at, i think it might be a dive bar or something but uh i'm gonna see if i can bring the camera all right. All right, we're supposed to be across the street there, but uh, let me check out this records and CDs and stuff. show here in Fourth Worth, Texas. Um, I know I didn't film much of the exhibit floor. I'll do a lot more of that tomorrow and Friday. I do apologize. Um, there was just a 
a lot of people I was talking to and for those of you that I met uh, thank you so much for your support and um, I truly truly appreciate it and thank you for giving me a time to talk to me it was fun thank you uh, let's see oh um, also um, Saturday there will be a meetup like I mentioned um, stay tuned on this channel I will post a picture or a location of where it's gonna be for Saturday after the ISS show I think the ISS show ends at 3 uh, we'll probably do something for like 4 30 or 5 let's just shoot for 5 to meet up at that location so stay tuned um, I probably won't post it in the morning but sometime in the afternoon uh, so be aware or stay tuned for that tomorrow if you guys want to just hang out with us and talk to us that'd be great that'd be awesome all right guys that's it i'll see you guys tomorrow peace